Hello, and thank you for joining me today on Live With A Purpose. Things break, and sometimes it can get repaired, and other times we just have to throw them out. Toys break, kids break things all the time. Sometimes when we're being clumsy and not careful, we break things, we lose things, we damage things. Have you ever looked into a mirror that was cracked, that was broken? You can still see yourself, but the image is distorted. It's as if the image, yourself, myself, is broken. And this is precisely what the image of God in us is when we are without Christ Jesus. When Adam and Eve sinned, when we've all sinned, we've distorted, we've broken the image of God in us. The image of God has not gone away, it's still there, but we're broken and we need repair. We need to be renewed to be renovated, to be transformed. Uh, how do we know that the image is still there? God's image is still in us. In Genesis 9-6, this is Noah towards uh, the end of uh, the flood and uh, the calamity that happened. It says, God says, Whoever sheds the blood of man, by man shall his blood be shed. For God made man in his own image. That is, God is reminding Noah and the survivors going forward, they should be reminded that the image is still in play. Sure, God's image is in us and was in them, but it was broken. It was renewed in Noah because he was a righteous man. And it is renewed in us because we are made righteous by the righteousness of Jesus. It is through the righteousness of the Lord Jesus Christ. It is through his image, his transformation, as in 2 Corinthians 3.18, that we are transformed into the image of Christ Jesus. We have been repaired. And uh, yes, we slip and uh, we do things that we're not supposed to do, but we get up again. We don't end up in heaven as broken people. In Christ Jesus, we have been made new. We are not perfect, but we are new in Christ Jesus. Consider this idea that, yes, the image uh, on the mirror is distorted because the mirror was broken. But when Jesus came and he sacrificed his life and he was resurrected from the dead, he restored the image in us. By his work. And so we, in essence, look in the mirror as if we're looking at Christ Jesus. Think about this today on Live with a Purpose.